Hello friends, back again to the Vito History Animals channel. We will discuss about the animal ruler of the ocean, namely the shark, superorder Salachimorpha. The existence of sharks was first discovered in the Ordovician period, to be precise around 420 to 450 million years ago. Sharks fall into the category of soft-boned fish because their skeletons are made of complete cartilage and streamlined bodies, not bone. The group that falls into the category of soft-boned fish is very broad, such as whale sharks, great white sharks, and also all kinds of stingrays. Thus, regardless of the size of each species, they have the same body anatomy. In sharks, the part that becomes hard bone lies only in their teeth. Sharks are different in that they do not have a swim bladder and hard bones in their bodies that help them swim. However, soft bones, which have a lighter density, allow sharks to survive and swim long distances to conserve energy. Sharks' ability to swim is also supported by their sharp eyesight. They can see in poorly lit areas, at night even in low light, and can see colors. The area behind the eyeball in sharks has a layer that can reflect light, known as the tapetum. This is what helps sharks to see very well in low light. In addition, shark skin is very similar in texture to sandpaper. This is due to the fact that it is made of structures similar to small teeth called placoid scales. These scales point toward the tail and help reduce friction when the shark swims. The first largest fish in the world is the whale shark or whale shark. This one fish has a body length that reaches almost 40 feet and weighs around 20,000 pounds or the equivalent of 9,071 kilograms. Whale sharks also have large mouths that are about 5 feet wide. Although it belongs to the shark species, the whale shark is known as a tame shark and its staple food is plankton, small shrimp, and small fish. Reporting from AZ Animals, the great white shark is the most dangerous and most aggressive shark in the world because it has recorded around 333 attacks on humans with 52 of them being fatal. Overfishing of sharks will cause the marine ecosystem to become unbalanced. As top predators, the existence of sharks is very important so that small fish populations can be maintained. The disappearance of sharks from the food chain will disrupt the balance of the marine ecosystem where medium-sized fish, which are shark food, will reproduce continuously so that their population increases, causing a crisis in the fish population below the food chain. Sharks are found in all oceans and are common at depths of 2,000 meters. They generally do not live in fresh water, with a few exceptions such as bull sharks and river sharks, which can live in both salt and fresh water. And sharks can survive for 20, 30 years.